Lego and bowling has been combined for decades, making wonderful additions to any bowling alley, like the compact ball return and the fabulous lane keeping machine. But there's always been one thing missing. TCAS has been developing an automatic pin setter machine since 2013, with the intentions of completing it just a few years later. As we all know, that did not happen. Nowadays, we have an automatic pin shutter machine operating for many frames, but it's not perfect. That's why we haven't released the instructions for it to the public yet. A few years ago, we began to see the daylight, and last year we were so sure about ourselves that we believed to be able to have a machine ready for this year. But, we are frank to admit, we haven't got it. All we got is something to show you, but we're going to be as honest as we have always been. It simply is not ready. Much time and money has gotten into the development of this machine, and it's simply a wonder to watch. For example, it can tell the difference between a strike, a spare, and an off-spot situation and act accordingly. First, let's see what happens when a bowler rolls a strike. The ball drops into the pit, which automatically engages the sweep. The pin setting mechanism descends to a surge position, finding no pins left standing. Knows that it's a strike, and deposits a new set of pins on the bed. The guard rises, and the alley is ready for the next ball. So much for the strike. Now let's see what happens with a spare. The mechanism descends, finds pins standing, picks them up, and holds them, while the sweep clears away the redwood. It then places them back in their exact position. The guard rises and the alley is ready for the next ball. Again, the ball engages the sweep. It travels to the end of the alley and the machine places a new set of pins for the next frame. Suppose the pins are knocked out of position, off the spot. What happens? Let's see. The mechanism descends, finds pins off spot. It then rises with the sweep, ready for the next ball. There certainly weren't any bugs in that operation, and there haven't been for quite some time. But we're still not satisfied that under the load of constant use, it will always work so perfectly. That's why we are not offering it yet. We would love to show you the intimate working details of this machine, so you could see just how it operates. But many new and ingenious ideas are involved, and we simply cannot take the chance of revealing too much until everything is fully completed. We think that we are well on the way of achieving the goal of which we have been seeking for over eight years. That's why we wanted to let you in on the progress we made. But we still can't make definite promises as to when we will have our perfect machine. After almost 20 years of Lego building, we are not going to compromise on quality now, and we are not going to ask anyone else to, who combines Lego and bowling. <laughs>